Hi, my name's Darren. I'm a member of the Retford Kettlebell Club and I just wanted to tell you a bit about kettlebells, kettlebells and why I do kettlebells. Um, it was November of 2010 when a colleague of mine at work said that he'd been to a Retford Kettlebell Club and told me how much fun he'd had working out and um, I just didn't get it really, he's, he's all quite excited about it and he's, um, he's telling me about this swing that they do in kettlebells and I found it quite comical to be honest and he's telling me during the day that you know you, when you swing this kettlebell you have to swing, you have to push with your hips, you have to, you have to thrust the kettlebell and um, it didn't really appeal, in all honesty it didn't appeal and I decided, since our first lesson was free, to give it a go. And I told him straight, I says, okay, I'll come to one lesson. The first lesson, seeing as that's free, I'm not going again. I, I decided that I wasn't going again. And I went for the first lesson a year last November. And I was exhausted at the end of it. And this, you know, I was using this ball of steel, an 8 kilo ball of steel with a handle on it um, for the best part of the exercises. Other than that I didn't use a kettlebell at all for some of the exercises. And uh, I enjoyed it. I really enjoyed the lesson and decided straight away I was going back. I wanted more of this. Didn't really know what I wanted to achieve. I play squash on a regular basis and I've been doing for maybe four years now, five years. Uh, so I thought I was pretty fit and then two, a day or so after I'd done this kettlebell lesson I could barely walk. <laughs> I'd use muscles I didn't know I got and for a few weeks doing just one lesson a week I was pretty exhausted at the end of it. Tired, aching muscles and anything that can work so much of your body has got to be doing you some good. Uh, I managed to talk my wife into going and both my wife and I um, do kettlebells on a regular basis either in our own garden round at Eric's, uh, Eric Walton's who is Captain Kettlebell, I don't know whether I should tell you that. Um, and we have so much fun. It's hard to believe that anybody can have so much fun working out. The, the sense of achievement that you get when you can do something, when you've moved up to the next weight, when you've done a certain amount of reps. I mean, these things are so versatile. You, you work in strength, you work in stamina, you work in your entire body. I've seen it called an entire gym in the palm of your hands, and they really can't be wrong, except some of them are that big, it uses two palms. But um, as to goals, I don't have many goals at all. I never really have set many goals. There are one or two challenges that I wanted to do. One I've achieved today, which I'm really pleased about. Um, I just want to get fitter and get stronger. I've, um, I've lost a lot of inches on my waist. I've put some inches on, on my arms and shoulders have all been built up, um, visibly so. People have mentioned how how much better I'm looking since well, less than a year that I've toned and got slimmer. I was never huge, I was never fat. I just wanted to lose a bit of weight and I, I've done that, I've achieved that. Um, now I just want to get fitter and stronger. No real goals. Um, I might set one or two little challenges for myself later on, but that's it. We have a great laugh um, <laughs> in the class. Everybody's friendly. You don't get that in a gym. People are on first name terms. We know everybody, and um, Facebook group really takes off. Everybody chats on Facebook. Um, give it a go. You, what have you got to lose? You, you, you never know, you might enjoy it. Um, I can't wait till the next lesson. Every week I look forward to next time I'm going to go and play with these lumps of steel with handles on.
Anyway, I've waffled on far too much. Thank you for listening. I'm Darren of the Retford Kettlebell Club. Thank you.